Hi, I'm Toby, a volunteer for ORTOC, the Oregon Robotics Tournament and Outreach Program. I'm here to share with you some top tips for making your robot look awesome in video. Making a video of your robot can be a lot of work, but it's more fun and you'll get a better result if you work with a team. Assemble your video team and figure out how to split up the work so that everyone gets a role. My team has been building this robot, which will be the star for the rest of our video. Let's get to the tips. Tip number one, make a plan. Wartop has a video toolkit made to help you figure out the beginning, middle, and end of your video. Once you have the flow of your video and a shot list, it's time to grab a camera. You don't need an expensive camera to film your robot. I'm filming this on my phone. Tip number two, pick your setting. Where do you want to film? Where do you have permission to film? I'm filming in a really big room with a stage, which is perfect for what I'm trying to do. Wherever you film, think about your background. Is it easy to see your robot against the background, or is the background too cluttered and distracting to make out what the robot's doing? Tip number three, pick your lighting. Lighting can make or break your video. At the very least, try to make sure your robot is easy to see. Here, the robot is partly in a shadow, so it's hard to see. Here, the robot is in front of a very bright background, so the robot is dark. And here, there's not enough light at all, so the overall image looks too grainy. And here, the robot is dramatically lit. That's really fun. And here, the robot is lit evenly, which makes the robot look really good. I really like using natural light from the sun whenever I can. Tip number four, remember to eat and drink. This tip might seem pretty obvious, but it's still really important to remember. Yeah, orders for Toby. Tip number five, film from different camera angles. When you film your robot from different angles, you'll have more options when you're editing your footage later on. And remember, film with your camera horizontally, like this, rather than vertically, like this. Tip number six, pick your music. I won't go into all the details of editing your video, but once you have your clips put together, you'll want to choose the right music for your video. Choose something that you have permission to use, and remember that the music choice can really affect the vibe of the video. That's it for now. If you follow all my tips, you'll definitely have a great video put together in no time. And keep in mind that if you're recording for a remote competition, there are other things you should keep in mind. Keep an eye on the latest information that FIRST has released to make sure that your video is following the latest guidelines. 